Hey guys. Hi guys. <laughs> um, we're gonna go over uh, following up with people um, when they like your picture and they respond either no thank you or they're not interested, they don't have money or whatever the case may be. Shauna's been talking me up today and I'm getting really excited because I have just been letting those people go. The ones that say no thank you, I just write them back, thank you so much. You know, if you're ever interested, let me know. Um, but she's been taking a lot of advice from Jade, a couple videos that I guess I haven't seen. And um, it's really working for her. So I want you to tell them the story about the girl that changed their mind. I have had two people change their mind and all I did was put them in my calendar for two weeks later and I said, hey, here's the product of the day. I was wondering if you were interested. They still haven't decided yet, but they are interested in, I think one of them is the Fat Fighters and the other one is Wraps. So hopefully this coming Friday, I will get them. It's, it's, it's really amazing, guys. And she was talking to me, too, when um, someone tells you no thank you, like she just said, you put them in for two weeks on your calendar. So the date that you spoke with them, count two weeks, 14 days, and follow up with them again. Just say, hey, how's it been going? Um, here's the special of the day. I was just wondering if you changed your mind. Different things like that will really help you connect with them and get, you know, kind of get past that barrier because they're watching your pictures still. They're still mm. following you. So what she told me today is obviously they're interested. Even though they said no, they're interested because they responded. They are giving you a response. There's, it's not like the people that don't that see the pictures and then don't say anything. These people are giving you a response. So they're thinking about it already. Give them that chance to think about it a little bit longer and then just keep following up, guys. Just keep following up. That's very, very important. And what else were we talking about earlier? Uh... Oh, how to follow up. Yes. What I do is I, I don't know what works for you guys, but what works for me is I put them in my calendar, the person I talk to, what they're interested in, and I put them in for that Friday. That following Friday, I follow up with them. They become, you know, either a loyal customer or distributor, whichever which. Um, and then, uh, what was I going to say? I lost track. I started staring <laughs> at the dog. <laughs> Sorry. Um, you put them in for two weeks. But do you put them in for two weeks when they don't give you a date? Yes. When they don't give you a date, follow up with them for two weeks. Or if they say they're running low on money, Fridays are paydays most of the time. So follow up on those Fridays. Friday mornings, you should have your calendar out. Be up bright and early and get those names down. Get those messages out. So basically, guys, the rules here are, um, we'll just kind of summarize. If you've had someone say no or, have it, or has not given you an answer, um, then you go ahead and put them down for two weeks when they don't give you an answer about a date. Um, if they have given you an answer about a date to follow up with them, make sure you put them in the calendar that day. And when you contact them, just say, hey, girl, you know, I just want to remind you I held a spot for you today. I want to make sure you get your discount for your stretch mark cream or wraps or whatever it is that they wanted. Um, if they didn't give you a date and you're just responding uh, for the two-week mark, then Shauna says she usually just writes them and says, hey, girl, have you thought about it? Um, what, you know, what, are there any other product, products that interest you? Um... What's the other one that Basically, you say? Basically, just ask them if they've changed their mind or ask them if they've seen any of our products that we've posted. It, ask them if they're interested in anything that they've seen so far. There you go. Uh, they go through our, you know, we're posting every hour on our three pictures minimum. An hour. I mean, come on. They're gonna see them. Right. So, if they do not reply at all, then I usually just delete it. Yes delete and then if they like again message again if they don't reply and they've seen your picture delete it again I mean what's the worst thing anybody could do I don't know why they don't answer I don't it bugs the crap out of me too <laughs> but well, I can't make them do it exactly exactly and we just have to keep moving forward guys you know, let's not focus on that negativity. Let's not focus on them not replying. Let's not focus on the fact that you know they said 
no, I'm still not interested or whatever the case may be. Let's not focus on the the ones that make the appointment and then don't get back to you. Oh. You had one this morning. I did. I did. I had one of those this morning and I'm pretty ticked off about it. But but you have to let it go and move on. I contact her again tomorrow, so it's okay. Exactly. You just <laughs> put them back down in your calendar. Um, sometimes people don't get the DMs. Sometimes you want to come sit. <laughs> sometimes this is my grandbaby Caleb. Say hi. My baby. Say hi. Um, sometimes they don't even get the DMs. I had a girl that's been taking me four weeks to even get her to order because she keeps saying, oh, I don't get the DMs. I'm really, really sorry. So she's still interested. I have t asked her several times to text me. She hasn't. Like Shauna said, you can't make them do it. Nope. But the key is to keep the communication line open and keep those follow-ups rolling and not feel like you're bugging them because that's how I feel. I feel like, oh my God, oh. I'm bugging them. They said they weren't interested. Nah. And Shauna's like, no, hey. do it, do it, do it. So they she's answered. pushing me. They gave you an answer. They thought about it. That they're interested. They just need to see more. Yeah. yeah. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> Don't touch the screen. Say hi. All right, you guys. I hope that helps you. If you have any questions, let us know. And um, keep those follow-ups going. Have your follow-up Friday completely filled. Mm -hmm. uh, me and Sean are pulling out extra pieces of paper oh, to write these follow-ups down because our calendar is shrinking by the minute, it feels like. And um, just keep it rolling, guys, because we're going to make it. All right? Say bye. bye. Say bye. bye. <laughs>